hey what's up to you welcome to my channel and in today's video I'm going to share with you guys six simple steps that is going to boost your PC or laptop speed by at least hundred percent trust me guys at the end of the video there's a clip that shows my laptop booting time so that you can understand my laptop configuration is also given in the description you can check that out also so let's start with this video so step number one is clean temporary files okay for that go to Windows type in run here press enter type percentile t e m p temp percentile and ok so it will show you all the temporary files so just control a select all the files press delete and hit yes so it will delete all the files but those which are currently in use it's not going to be deleted so don't worry about it skip it so that's it so this way you can clear your temporary files so step number two is check for registry errors okay uh, sometimes due to failed installation or uninstallations some part of the software remains on your computer and it also creates some registry errors okay so this may uh, cause some slowness in your PC so clean your registry check for any broken registry and clean your browser temporary files also for that purpose you can use tools like CC cleaner I have, I have installed CC cleaner you can see that this is CC cleaner just open that uh, there's a registry tab click on that scan for issues it will show you all the issues related to your registry okay you can just click here fixed selected issues and that's it you can clean your browser temporary files and cache memory also from this cleaner tab just analyze so not now actually so analyze it and you can run cleaner to clean all this stuff okay okay now step number three install a good antivirus okay so you might be thinking that how it is related to speed but trust me guys if your PC is infected then it will show lot of advert effects as well as slowness and sometimes your PC may get stuck also for that purpose get a good antivirus there are a lot of antivirus available with uh, trial versions you can try that and if it boosts your computer performance then you can uh, go for purchasing it okay now step number four is disk defragmentation so disk defragmentation is uh, sometimes there are bad sectors in a hard disk okay that that may cause some slowness uh, during the read write operations of your hard disk so what what you need to do install some disk defragmenters there are a lot of disk defragmenters available like this one the Oslogix disk defrag it's a free tool you can install that and you can use that to uh, heal your bad sectors in your hard disk okay so this is the fourth important step so these four steps are completely related to software fixings and now comes to the most important step that is hardware specification so guys it doesn't matter how much you tweak up with your software uh, you need the backup from your hardware also so it is highly recommended that you upgrade your hardware specifications also so just by investing a little bit of money you can greatly improve your PC performance so the first step is upgrade your RAM okay so if you are using heavy tools like Photoshop or Android Studio or playing high-end graphic games then it is highly recommended to upgrade your RAM okay I would recommend 8 GB of RAM uh, and it will cost you around sixty dollars okay so let's see uh, if you go to Amazon there are a lot of RAMs available here uh, 8 GB that is 4000 rupees that is around sixty dollars there are a lot of brands uh, out of which uh, I would recommend Corsair or the Crucial these two brands are really good for making uh, RAMs okay so you can purchase from Amazon or any local store so uh, it is good if you have 4 GB RAM but uh, but you may feel some lagging when you run the heavy applications so it is recommended to go for the 8 GB RAM okay so second and the most important hardware in the list is SSD SSD stands for solid state drive so they are pretty similar to your hard disk but the difference is that they are way faster than your hard disk almost 5 to 10 times faster okay but they are costlier also 
you will get 120 GB of uh, 120 GB of uh, solid state drive or SSD at around 4000 rupees that's that's around 60 to 65 dollars so the storage space is pretty pretty less okay so it's not actually for storing all your data or media files in this SSD the trick is only install operating system or softwares that you generally use uh, in the SSDs by doing that whenever you will start your computer it will boot from the SSD and it will be a lot faster and launching your applications will be faster also like clicking on this Chrome and it get opened in a flash so this way you can use SSDs to make your computer a lot faster okay so that's pretty much all I have now so let's uh, look at the video that shows my computer booting time so thanks for watching